Hey, Kekka's Boy here, back with more Wonder Girl and the Dragon's Trap, reminding you to like, comment, and subscribe. Every little bit helps me out. We're going to reach that 100 with your help. Apparently, the sound for the last video got lost, so here I am going to be recording something else. Now, this one we're going to be talking about what just happened in the realm of Marvel, Disney, and Sony. Now, for those of you who don't know, Marvel has apparently just lost the rights to uh, Spider-Man in the MCU. And a lot of people are going to be blaming Sony for this because of Sony pulling the character. No. This is one of those cases where if you're going to point the finger, if you're going to point, place blame, you're pointing this at Disney. Now, why you may ask? Well, apparently Disney and Sony were renegotiating the deal after an agreement that came up uh, after the performance of Spider-Man Far From Home. Now the deal that they had currently, or that they, yeah, the deal that they used to have was that Sony would get 95% of the box office and Disney would be getting 5%. Now some people are going to be thinking, hey, that's crazy, Disney's not making anything. Well, that's off of the box office. You see, what a lot of people don't get is that the box office is pretty much the weakest portion of where a film makes its money. And while Disney was getting 5% of the box office, they were getting 100% of the merchandising rights. So every single toy, t-shirt, poster, Halloween costume, all of that went straight to Disney. And that is really, really where all the money is. With the renegotiation that Disney was trying to do, they were trying to take 50% of the box office receipts while holding on to 100% of the merchandising rights. They were essentially strangling Sony for more money right here. Now, it's Disney, it's a company, they're going to want money, but apparently Sony thought that they could hold out and push back at this. There were some counter offers which I'm not currently aware of, but they were uh, basically turned away. So now we have both companies going back to their corners and we're going to be seeing what happens from there. Now, Tom Holland is actually still signed up with Sony, because the Spider-Man stuff, Far From Home, Homecoming, those are Sony movies, those aren't Marvel movies. They're connected to the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but they're not Marvel movies. So that is where we stand right now. Uh, Tom Holland's still going to be doing the next two Spider-Man movies. But as things stand, those movies are not going to be in the MCU. Now, I'm going to ask all of you, what do you think? Do you think that Disney's being greedy, or do you think that they should have more control over all this stuff? Now, you see a lot of people are saying that well, they're saying that Sony needs Disney more than Disney needs Sony. But one thing that you all are going to have to realize is that Spider-Man is big. Spider-Man is real big. Spider-Man is the top grossing superhero of all time. The Spider-Man movies as a whole have made more than any other movie franchise other than the Avengers films. Spider-Man's made more than Iron Man. Spider-Man's made more than Black Panther. Spider-Man's made more than Superman and Batman. Spider-Man makes bank. Now, I heard you're also saying, quality. You don't want more Amazing Spider-Man movies. I don't want more Amazing Spider-Man movies. Nobody wants more Amazing Spider-Man movies. Those movies sucked. You know it, I know it, and you're worried that if it all goes straight back to Sony completely, that you're just going to get a bunch of bad, crappy movies. Okay, well, forget about all that stuff. 
Anyway, as I used to say in a lot of my older videos, Disney is a company. Sony is a company. Neither of these people are your friends, neither of these people are your family, unless they are, in which case, uh, hello Disney family, uh, send me some money, I would like that. But anyway, they're just people playing to money, and they're trying to get some. So, don't pick sides, pick the truth of what is going on in the business. That's the only real thing that matters. They're gonna do what makes them money, and if what they make is good, watch it. If what they make is bad, don't watch it. Don't pick sides based off of just, oh, I like this movie. You know what? It was fun letting some of that stuff out. I think I'm gonna do a couple more of these. Um, but for now, let's just sit back, listen to some music, and enjoy some mediocre gameplay of Wonder Girl and the Dragon's Trap. Might pipe back in if there's something else I feel like talking about. just a little bit of stuff. So I've really been enjoying this game and I'm still getting everything switched and move around after my move into my new place. Hopefully everything will get put in order, I'll get the camera set up and I'll be able to do some more on camera videos because I liked a lot of those. I liked uh, my lovely audience seeing my lovely face. Uh, possibly doing some good old costume stuff and getting set up. Right now we're kind of out getting to the end of LARP season. I've been too busy to get most of that stuff done, but you don't need a LARP to get a costume, so I plan on trying to do some more of that. Now I also plan on trying to get a schedule set a little bit more, but for that I'm going to need your help. I want people in my audience to start putting in suggestions, games they want to see me play, uh, videos of mine that they've enjoyed, and they might want to see more of that type of run. I know I've been all over there with a lot of the different types of videos, but I just have so many different types of things I like doing. I'm going to, I promise you, I'm going to get things organized. That's just a thing that's going to happen. So bear with me now, and thanks for sticking through all the crap I've been putting out. Well, if you stuck with me through this much of the video, thanks for tuning in. Now we're just going to go back in and enjoy the rest of what's going on. This is Kekker's Boy, not signing out, but quieting down. Enjoy.
Mm-hmm. 